I'll share one other tool with you that I think is, is very powerful and that is, um, this is a tool called Pull Everywhere. And you think about, you know, resources in the classroom and teachers, you know, always looking for ways to have additional technology, but one of the things is funding. Trying to fund programs like uh, those clickers, those response units or whiteboards that, you know, either PTA raises money, the school district finds money, but something as simple as this. One of the things we always say in our school systems is uh, shut your cell phones off when you come to school or you can use them after school in the hall, but in the classroom we shy away from that. What a valuable technology. This is a little a tool called Poll Everywhere. And what Poll Everywhere does allows you to post a question. So I could say, all right, how, you know, here's our problem we're going to look at today. You know, what do you think the correct answer is, A or B? Well, what you can do is you can type in your answer as a text message. You send that text to the appropriate address, and immediately the teacher can see a quick poll on how quick kids responded. So if something as simple as this, which we know what, probably 90% of students in, in middle high school would have a cell phone. Mm -hmm. So what if we could use something so out of the box, but yet something everyone has to say, here's a stated problem for our lesson today and kids respond and the teacher quickly gets the data and I saw this done in a classroom where um, the, the teacher was going to uh, determine what the kids wanted to learn first. Here, here's three topics we're going to discuss. I want you to text which one we should do first. So what is most interesting to you? They text, you saw the data, and that's what we're going to start on first. Again, a tool, something as simple as Poll Everywhere, um, you go to that site, you create your poll. Again, this is a free tool. You, you would create your poll, publish that poll, embed that on your website. You could embed it right in here in the, your K, uh, MK12 uh, profile. Use that in your classroom. But as soon as I create my poll, I have my students text. So you see things from publishing, from data analysis, from uh, various components, including writing, reading, math, so many things that you